So, see, we're driving. Where we going? What we doing? Hola, amigos. Today's the day. We've been uh, waiting for this day for about a couple months. So it's an exciting day. Um, what kind of clues can you give us? Clues? Well, I don't know. I don't know what kind of a clue. All right, so a clue would be um, it's close. It's important to me. It has to do with cheapy, obviously. Any more clues? No. I won't be the same after we're done. Ooh, Ooh that's a good one. It's a good one. Stay tuned. <laughs> so we're getting ready, folks. It's time. It's on the countdown. So we're here. We're getting cleaned up. It's going down. It's the least hairy I've ever seen your arm in my life. <laughs> you gotta capture it. Yes, sir. Oh my god, really? Yeah, this is my first one. So let's say this, for an example, so you have, <laughs> after all these years of doing this, mm -hmm. I'll say, I can say that every tattoo is special, even to me, like, even like if the person is just getting it because they just want to get it, to uh -huh. me it's special. Um, but in our world, uh, whenever you do freehand, <laughs> it's, it's almost like the toughest Um, how do you say that? Like, like it can't get any more special than that. Yeah. Unless it's freehand, you know what I mean? Like, even like, I can totally, definitely like have a stencil for it and get it ready, and it'll still be perfect. Mm -hmm. But to me, and in my opinion, whenever it's freehand, it's always like built for you, right? For your arm, for how your muscle structures are, so it just looks yeah. better somehow. And that's what I thought, like, last night. <clears throat> it's really important to you as much as it is important to me. Not as much, I mean, couldn't be as much, but it is really important to me, though. <laughs> I appreciate that. He's like, this knee, a traditional thing? I need to do, do, do. And then he can't do it. How? <laughs> like, oh, this is a neck tattoo. It's so hard. Then, what? Why are you gotta, in a fucking it up. Yeah, see, that's the thing. And then, and it would make people treat us differently now, too. And they're like, 
I don't know, like people dress way different now because of that show and it really bothers me. Because we're not like, we're more like, again, let me go back to back in history. So it used to be to get the thing and then the artist draws it for you for like 12 days and you come and you get that. That's what you get. Right. And then it was drawn for you. That for, Just like what I do, like I draw it for you and that's what you get. And it's going to be yours. No one else is going to have the same thing ever. But now, it's more like, oh, you know, I don't like this. And then they change it because in the show they change it and it's okay, but that's not okay. You know what I mean? Oh, no. That's a show thing. And then people are treating us like this. They're treating us like a, uh, like a, like a product or like a show or like something. So I get what you're saying. Not it's an, really not humiliating. An you're not an artist. You're just doing some, you're just doing a service. Yeah. So okay. it's but it's not like that. It's not supposed to be like that. Get too excited. First ink. First ink ever. I can't really see why uh, you would not want that on your neck. Especially the trippiest part, actually, is when you're on the numbness, where, when you're numb, I can feel it vibrating, but I don't feel a damn thing. So That's the, that on, trippy. it's so annoying, too, like, it gets to the point where you're like, do I want to feel it or not? <laughs> I'm like, this is weird, I don't feel anything. And then all of a sudden you feel it, because I jumped on it. a different spot, right. like, fuck. So you're always, like, uh, like, waiting for the moment where you're gonna yeah. feel it or not. So we're about four hours in. So, what's your take? How's it going? Looks like what? Ah, it's going great. I'm enjoying this so much. It's like working on a painting. That's the difference between like doing a freehand and a stencil tattoo. It's a. Uh, it's like a. It feels like a painting. It feels like working on an actual painting. You still got plenty of energy to finish it out? Oh. I never run out of energy. He runs out of lidocaine. He runs out of space that's been numb. Mm-hmm. That's you. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> oh, there you go. You found it. It sounds like a you problem. <laughs> that's not a me problem. It's a you problem. Any challenges or um, hiccups? Because of the person's arm. The person's arm. <laughs> I think she's trying to throw some shade. I know he's a bit tall. <laughs> he's a bit tall. I ran out of ink. This dude's arm. <laughs> I put, I poured some ink like right now. <laughs> <laughs> kind of did. <laughs> Thank you. 
That's it. That's all the red. <laughs> <laughs> Just the highlight right there. The way I do color is very different. How so? I use liners for color. Liners is liners and needles. I use the small needles for every process for the whole thing. So that's what makes what makes it a signature, I say. It's uh it's not the most efficient way to do it, but to me it's like really good. Hurts more, basically. <laughs> I was gonna ask you whether it hurts more or less when you're talking it about it. It hurts shit. more because uh, I'll have to go yeah. on doing more passes until it's saturated. Gotcha. How's it going in there? Good. All is well. How's your arm feel? Good. Numb. So you get to figure out where it's numb and where it's not numb. And where it's not numb, then you remember it's a tattoo. dinner break so getting we're a little on, hungry we're on dinner break so what are you thinking of the process so far what, what do you think of sal sal's awesome he's incredible he's doing an amazing job it's it's mind-boggling how someone can one draw on paper but two then make it look the same way with the shading and the contouring and the highlighting on skin like it really is very very impressive right on Reveals coming soon. Stick with us. Did it hurt? No. You got a tough guy. Right? Yeah. And my teeth in the man. Oh, I, I forgot one more tall guy joke. Do you play basketball? Uh, <laughs> badly. <laughs> All right, we're at the end of it. It's video. It's video. Oh, it's video. <laughs> You're so weird. So, how did it go? It went perfect. Yeah. Seated my every expectation. By far the most badass person ever. Uh -huh. Like in what way? And in, in sitting, not moving, not complaining, not saying anything, really taking it really well. Uh, guys, especially, guys are the worse when it comes to pain <laughs> so you proved me wrong today Thanks, we appreciate you thank you